Now the moments an 11 year old and his dad are surprised at school by deputies after they lost almost everything in a massive apartment fire just a day after Thanksgiving. It's an incredible moment and ABC 13's Giovanni Ligi has that and more as he joins us live from outside the Harris County Jail tonight. Giovanni. Well, Tom, talk about going above and beyond the duties of your job. That's exactly what those deputies did for this family who lost almost everything in that apartment complex fire just before the holidays. Right now, 11 year old Kai and his father are steps closer to putting their lives back together. The single father was at work when the apartment complex they were living at caught on fire. I woke up and I smelled something. It smelled like a candle, so I opened the door and I saw a massive fire in the corner of the house. Kai narrowly escaping the flames by punching through a window the day after Thanksgiving, but the fire quickly chewing through all of their belongings, leaving them with almost nothing. They're all my school babies and I have a 13 year old myself. Megan Delonto is a school resource officer at Clear Lake Intermediate School in Southeast Houston, and she took on the mission to figure out a way to help Kai and his father before the holidays. She started by donating her own Christmas tree to the family. Immediately it hit my mama heart that, you know, he lost everything and I just knew that we had to, we had to help him. With the help of Sergeant Tommy Ingerson, Clear Lake Principal Jesse Kimball and Deputy Claus. We grabbed some toys for him with from the toy drive and then one of our, the AP was suggested that we possibly get with the mattress Mac and I was like, ah, that's brilliant. Kai was sleeping on an air mattress and didn't have many clothes to wear to school. So together and with the help of a local furniture store, they got him what he needed. So look, no more air mattress. But Kai didn't know who did this for him, the gifts and the mattress. But the moment he realizes the deputy he grew close to every day at school did this for him. Oh, you. <laughs> Together, this group went above and beyond the call of duty and teaching responsibility by helping 11 year old Kai and his father bring their lives steps closer back to normal. My name's Kai McWhorter. Merry Christmas. And Tom, the man accused, police accuse 36 year old Ashner Colbert of starting that fire. He's currently being held on a $250,000 bond here in jail and is due back in court at the end of January. But really a heartwarming story, those deputies coming together to help that 11 year old Tom.